water looks amazing. Turkey turn. Here we go. Good morning. Yesterday we left the Cabo area and headed north. We took the inland route and last night we camped out at the Tropic of Cancer Monument. It was a great spot to spend the night and I will show you it quickly. So here's one of the monuments. So this is where we are right now and the next time that we will be here on the Tropic of Cancer will be when we're on the mainland. So the plan for today is we are going to keep driving north and we are heading to the East Cape to go explore more of that area. We saw a little bit of it when we went to La Fortuna, but the road driving from the south is quite washboardy, so we're gonna drive it from the north where it's more paved. Cabo Palmo is a small uh, village on the East Cape of Baja in a remote part and it's famous for having an enormous and uh, supposedly very vibrant reef. Uh, it's really really famous for divers and snorkelers and is one of the best spots in North America to go snorkeling. So we're super excited to be going. It's one of the few spots we haven't been and we're really excited to go check it out. has begun. <laughs> so we have about 15 kilometers of washboards and then we'll be there. It's gonna be a good time to shut off the stabilization of the camera. <laughs> We just stopped by the visitor center. He showed us where we can go park for the night, as well as where the main street in Cabo Palmo is to go explore. So we're just heading over to the main strip now to go scout out a dive shop to book a snorkeling tour. Wait, let me go. Here comes Finley. leash on the beaches right now because there are no turtles nesting. There is a turtle nesting ground just a little bit north but there's no turtles right now. So we're just making our way up to the free camping just north of Cabo Palmo. It's still on the ocean and we're gonna hang out there until tomorrow and then we'll come back into town and do our snorkeling tour. So we came into town yesterday and walked around and we ended up booking a snorkel tour for this morning. So we just pulled into the dive shop. We're going to go out on a boat and then do four snorkels at different locations around the reef. We're super excited, so hopefully we see lots of fish. We got our snorkel gear, an overview of the reef, and a quick history lesson on Cabo Palmo before heading out to the boat. Today, Cabo Palmo is a national marine park and a UNESCO World Heritage Site. Here we go! But it hasn't always been this way. Originally, it was a village supported by commercial fishing. 
But in the 1980s, the community noticed the negative impact overfishing and pollution were having on the environment. The reef was dying and the fish were gone. The community lobbied the Mexican government to declare Cabo Palmo waters a protected area. And in 1995, Cabo Palmo was declared a national marine park. The locals made the switch from commercial fishing to conservation and ecotourism. Okay? Maybe there's very, very shallow. We have to be careful with the bottom. Are you ready? Mm -hmm. Okay, one, two, three, now. Today, the biomass of the fish in the reserve has increased almost five times compared to nearby unprotected waters. This is the largest increase observed in any protected area and proof that protecting areas can help restore ecosystems. We didn't get the best view of the sharks from the boat, but from the sky was a completely different story. There's a van. Hi. Yes, you're a good boy. Did you have a nap? 
Here he comes. Wilson. Vamos al hueso. Will this do, Finley? Gracias. So pretty. So that's spicy. Not ridiculously spicy. That means this is probably habanero. <laughs> Yep, 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 yep. Fish tacos. Ceviche. You think to try it? Yeah, never had ceviche before. Oh, heat. That is nice. We're just leaving the main area of Cabo Pulmo and we're going to head a little further south to a place called Los Frieles where we're hoping we can camp for the night. Uh, we've decided we're going to go and camp at where we camped last night. So we're heading back up the road just past town. We'll have a lovely sunset and sunrise and then we'll probably uh, head out of Cabo Palmo. We have had some great snorkeling, some great views and a fun time here. And uh, I think it's about time we start getting ready for the mainland. So, thanks for watching, and we will see you guys there. We've got one more stop to make before we head to the mainland. Subscribe to join the journey, and we'll see you in La Ventana.